What in the hell is this? What is what, Adam? Let's start there. What is what? Don't do not do that. Why are you like a London cop? You look weird. A London cop is crazy, bro. Disrespecting my brand is crazy. Disrespecting my brand. Uh, Smoking uniform is crazy. Having a tiny chilled Gatorade is crazy. I'm off, I'm off the clock right now. I'm off the clock. Mm. I'm, I'm, no, I'm not on duty. Not on duty. Not on duty. It hit different. I just, I don't even know what to say to you. Oh, my God. I got a 50, Adam. Let's start there. Because you been f***ing around. You oh, okay. Up. We're going to start with this. Let's start there. Let's start there. You know, they already been telling me, J. Mano, go back to No Jumper. Who's telling you that? Everybody telling me this bro. They say Adam over whooping, bro. Let's start there. They, he disrespected Mama Duck. He disrespected How did I disrespect Wolski. Mama Duck? What is that about? Where did that rumor come from? Now, let's let's put all the facts out here. What did you say? Put it like this. This how they coming at me. Because they, J-Man, you the voice right now. You the only one talking to Adam. We can't talk to Adam. So we need you to talk for us to Adam, bro. Why the f*** is you letting him disrespect Mama Duck? Remo I, was there. Okay. She was trying to f Mama Duck was trying to f who? Like me. But, like, not, like, literally trying to but she was like around with me like she was really saucing me up like she was flirting with me you know like when there's like an auntie type and she don't want to like actually Mama you. Duck is a freak bro but, <laughs> but saying she <laughs> with white men is crazy let's start there why is that crazy I've never seen Mama Duck with a white man let's I heard start she, there she used to date uh, white white folks white folks I never let's put that rumor out there with, with white folks and, and Mama Duck, you ever seen that? No, they kept it low. I never seen no like that. It was a forbidden stop, romance. Stop creating false narratives, bro. I mean, that's Now, you a got rumor. me out here in Chicago vouching for you and shit. Now, they, yeah, you for Adam. I'm, yeah, that's my boy. I was supposed to go to his party. I, I couldn't make it. It hit different when I missed a birthday bash. It hit different. Blueface was in that bitch over whooping. Y'all don't think I wanted to be there? But what happened? Adam over whooping, talking about Wooski slow. He got shot in the head. He been listening to, to too much King. Do you think Brian, he would have got packed out of the party? Who got packed out? Uh, do you think you would have? By who? They aren't gonna let you bring the fifty in there. They ain't gonna let me bring my fifty. I bug the f up. It hit <laughs> who ain't gonna let me bring my fifty? Um, why wait, didn't is you that make real? This party? What is it real? Don't you see what what, what PGF Nook say? Uh, tape around that just to make sure it fit do your homework on what PGF Nook said in that song let's stay on Mama Duck tape around the mat just to make it fit we did what that interview and I personally was deeply moved her story affected me on a very primal level just hearing her story like I was the most moved that I felt by an interview in a while and then all the fan pages and, and internet characters like yourself start putting out this narrative that I was disrespecting her or something like that. First of all, I asked her if she got turned on when she saw you having sex with someone. That's disrespectful to ask FBG Duck Mama, bro. She's a human being. So what if we ask Adam Mama, um, yeah, would do you do you want to f FYBJ no, man? How would you feel? How would you feel? It would be like How the mom you walked feel? in on Remo piping. And she, you know, and I asked her, like, oh, did you did you like it? Did you like seeing Remo Pipe? You like looking at young... We not going to ask Mama 22 no sh like that. But you we could. got respect, bro. My mom also doesn't do interviews. If she was putting herself into those situations, I think it would be fair to ask her if she got a little bit turned on when she saw a beautiful young man like yourself. Just so, because sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I know we said we weren't going to do any gay shit. That's homosexuality, bro. Where, where's, where's my shit? <laughs> where's my Is my shit over there? The where's gun? my shit? I guns need, hold on, hold on. Homosexuality, that's that's a cold 305. That, that's at least a, a 305 or something. God damn it. Hold on. You over whooping, bro. Oh, you have like a ticket book? You, a ticket book is crazy. Hold on. Your ass is over whooping. I don't think it's like gay to just acknowledge that you have a decent body. I'm not saying you're like Mario Lopez or anything. Hell no. But you look no. guy. <laughs> my pen, my pen. Hold on, hold on. Yo, that's a 305, code 305. A marker is crazy. A code 305. Hold on. <laughs> a marker is crazy. Homosexuality. <laughs> flag on the play. That's homosexuality. That's code 305. That's 305. Jay man you get too many tickets. Ticket. You get too many tickets, your ass getting locked up, Adam. Damn, it that's a code different. 305? You, you code 305 right now. That, uh, that, it hit different. Now, look. I was that, just seeing it from her perspective. She's a woman. She's looking at you. You look all right. She's probably enjoying watching you. And I don't understand how that's disrespectful to the legacy of her, of her son who's passed away. What you mean you don't understand how that's disrespectful? This is a mother on the internet 
over whooping for her son. She just lost her son, bro. So you don't even know what the f she really feeling in her mind. That's bogus, bro. So, yeah, is you want to FYBJ, man? That's disrespectful. Cause vice versa. That's that's duck peoples. So if FBG Duck was here, would you be doing that, bro? Let's start that. People don't play with Duck like that. People don't play with FBG. FBG Duck, they don't play with him. Let's she was telling that. a story. She saw you piping. I I felt like it wasn't that much of a leap to say like, did you enjoy it? Because if Remo told me that he saw two people on the side of the street today, that would probably be the first thing I say is, well, Remo, did you get a little bit of a boner watching that? Because that's just what I would want to know. Don't ask nobody mama that, Adam. <sighs> What's wrong with you? Bro, it's not like he died yesterday. It's been three years. I feel like it's Bro, fair I don't give a to talk it was to him like years. a normal human being. I don't give a if it was 20 years. First, first of all, people hurt and mourn in different ways, Adam. Just because you got over your people's dad quick as hell don't mean she going to ever get over her son, Dan. It hit different. It's levels of this shit. Vice versa. We seen famous Richard come out and say something about your daughter. You took that very personally. We'll get to that. So how do you know where the line draws, That's a bro? separate clip. So you, We're going to stay on Mama Duck. Okay, and stay I'm on gonna, Mama Duck. Okay, this is the thing. Because that's the same. It's bro. not like she came into the interview acting like a saint. She was flirting with me when we took the pictures. She's saying Whoa, some flirtatious flirt. shit. It's not like she's a nun who comes in here and has this very pristine, holy image or anything. She's making it pretty apparent that she's with the bull. So I didn't feel like it was that much of a stretch given the conversation. Now, if you if you remove all the context and you're just like, oh, Adam asked Mama Doug if she would get turned on watching J-Main. I, I feel you. But in the context of the interview and the that we were already talking about, I didn't really think that it crossed any lines. Did Mama Duck say it was disrespectful? And that's on whoops. Mama Duck said his ass was over whooping. And, and she getting that. And he over whooping like that, J Man. And, and Mama, oh. They say, oh. I say, they ain't pay you? Bro. A couple. Miss, missing a payment is crazy. I say, Adam, Mr. 22, when I just sent you with over whooping at your birthday party. How much did that party cost, Adam? Let's start there. We told her we would pay How for the flight. How much blue face booking she fees? Got first class, and then she's booking rooms at the Ritz-Carlton. I'm sorry. We don't normally pay like $800 for the room or whatever. So we, we told her that we couldn't reimburse, reimburse her for the entire amount. I don't know why she thought that she just had like a blank check to book whatever reservation she wanted in this thing. First of all, bro, that's Mama Duck. When you gave back to the old Blackians, treat Mama Duck. As such, bro, because Mama Duck is the, that's the mother of Duck, bro. What the f*** is you talking about? I don't give a f how much her room was. Pay that lady room, boy, and whatever the f*** else she want, boy. Is you crazy? So because she's the mother of a legendary rapper, we have to pay any hotel room that she wants? I think that my team made it pretty clear that we were not trying to pay for a five-star hotel. What are we talking about on this platform? Chicago sh right? When, we, when you got the Jay Mays up here, we mentioned in Duck in some way. You got the Tay Savages, the Lil Reese. We mentioned in Duck in some type of way, bro. So for this man to be gone and we got his mama up here, we got to we gotta pay 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 her as she weigh. And she a big motherfucker. Let's start there. Let's start there. <laughs> pay her how much she weigh. Let's start there. Let's start there. It ain't different. So how are you going to talk about being respectful of Mama Doug when you just made a goddamn fat joke? I can make fat jokes about my that, that's my family, bro. Okay. I can I can make jokes with Mama Duck. That's don't didn't you just see us over whooping? Don't didn't you just see us going to the schools over whooping? She know I'm a comedian. Mm. It hit different.